Hi, welcome to Pay for Coffee Creations. Thanks for taking time out of your day to hang out, chit-chat, coffee, create with me. I did it again. I went to Hobby Lobby. I was watching Chubby Lovey's channel and she hauled some of these stencils. And I love to use texture paste with stencils, but some of the stencils don't hold up. So when I saw her using them, um, not using them, but purchasing them, I, ding, 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 they're made for frosting. So they will definitely hold up to um, some lovely little texture paste, right? So I only found three that I liked, and I loved this one. There's a picture there. And that shows you what it is. It's really pretty. So I got that one. And then I saw this one. And it's a little bit similar. I don't know if that picture is going to show very well. But it's a little bit similar in the pictures. But they're not 100% the same. So there, this one is much larger leaf style. And this one is much skinnier and more together. And for the price, $1.99, and it's a nine and a quarter by 11 inch stencil. And then look at that roses. Is that gonna show for you? Are you gonna be able to see that one? Isn't that pretty? Really gorgeous. So they were on sale, 40% um, off. So I got one of each of those. They had a couple others, but I really loved those. And then the paper. Uh, studio was on sale again for 40% off and I needed some more of this lovely stuff um, I got a new thing that I want to try and share with you so I got that and hello Halloween box I almost called it a Halloween box it is a Valentine's box these are much sturdier than last year it's almost like a chipboard box much much sturdier and it was 90% off, so I only paid 49 cents for that one. I kind of went around the store just to uh, take my time meandering around and checking things out. And last week, my hubby bought some of this stuff. It's the pre-mixed paint pour acrylics. And he's really been doing a great job with the acrylic paints. And... Um, the pre-mixed so he bought we bought um one a couple i think it was nine colors total and one of them we thought was black ended up being purple so i got him the black and they were 7.99 down to a dollar 99 so i got him the black i'll surprise him with that and i found these <clears throat> excuse me and it is a watercolor gel. I had to look it up because I've never heard of it before. It's translucent acrylic paint. So you take this and you put it over your watercolors and you can change up your colors and whatnot. And it was $2.59 down to $0.64. Cents. So I got both of those. Got some more of these because I use these so much that I'm running out again. So I got some more of those. And then I got these lovely needles in the leather department. I needed one of these that was working, would work for leather and perfect. Beautiful. 99 cents. Couldn't go wrong. And then I needed some orange embroidery floss and some green and brown and some more of this color. And they were $3.49. They're marking them down to $2.99. So they're going to start carrying them at $2.99, but the colors are gorgeous. And I used up a lot of my colors doing the Easter eggs. <clears throat> oh my goodness, excuse me. I apologize again. And then, uh, so I used them up on the Easter eggs, and I sold all my Easter eggs to one person. I was really shocked. So I needed to refill my colors. And then I found this. It's the little hearts. Can you believe it? And it was 49 cents. It's the little candy hearts. I mean, they're not the greatest looking little words, but you know what they are. And I can't make them out because of the way the words are. 
for the most part. I think they're like, wow, and stuff like that, XO, XO. But they are great to put into Happy Mails. And I figured for 49 cents, it's so worth it. They are so adorable. I got those. Then I got some lovely little boxes. These are so cute, and I love that little thing on the front there. And they were $2.49 down to $1.24. They're so cute, and I needed some to hold my ATC cards and my sentiments because it's bigger. <laughs> I should have got the third one, but I decided to leave the third one. They're so cute. They're pink polka dots. They're 6.61 inches by 4.65 inches by 4 inches. They are perfect. I may just use them for sentiments and for other ephemera. So, got that. And then the last thing I got, I was so excited. Uh, the ribbons and trims were on sale for 40% off. So 40% off these beauties. And they put it, the signs, in the wrong place. But the, the girl honored it. And how gorgeous. Let me flip this over so you can see that so much better. And I think I'll bring it down as well. How gorgeous is that trim? Is that not pretty? Isn't that beautiful? I bought two yards of this one. It was originally 99 cents a yard and it was 40% off. So I got two yards of that one because that is gorgeous and it's going to be absolutely beautiful on journals and ephemeras. And then I found this one. Now this is a sequin one, but it stretches. <laughs> it is a stretchy one. I have not seen these ones. It stretches. How cool is that? That would make a great binding to put on a journal to go around it. Let me see if I got a little one here. I can show you what I mean. I do. So that would make a great, like, to go around it like that. And it could be, like, the closure. So you have that, like, little thing there. And that's your closure to your journal. How pretty would that be, right? So I got it in this bronzy color, really gorgeous. And then I got it in black. They had gold and like a silver, but they, they just didn't, uh, the colors didn't really like, do it for me on those two. But I love the black and it stretches as well. Really pretty. So I got those two. And the last trim I got is this beautiful little one. Oh, so the sequin ones were $1.49 a piece. So you got the bronzy and that black one. They were $1.49 a piece. Normal price. And I paid $0.89 cents each. So they were 40% off. Really pretty. This one, this gorgeous. I don't know if that white is going to... Be a great color to show you that so let's try this one here I think that might show up a little bit better maybe maybe I need a different color I think this color works a lot better how pretty and dainty is that trim isn't that gorgeous it's just a little tiny one and it's so pretty and I thought that would be gorgeous to do like the edging on a journal. I have that belly band on there. I'll move that off. How gorgeous would that be? Like on the edging of a journal. Like up against a colored paper, right? Isn't that pretty? Or even just tucked onto the edge of that trim. It would be really gorgeous, right? So pretty. I love that really pretty right say it like you can see it that well so let's do this this might work a little bit better so you can actually see it better there we go so you got your trim of your like 
the composition book and then you have that trim on there how pretty would that be right I thought that was a really gorgeous trim so that is my little haul um, this is one of the books <laughs> I finished well I'm still working on finishing for fairs and whatnot um, but yeah that's my little haul thanks for watching have a great day and I'll see you in the next video